Frankenstein. Are we being partitioned on either side? Being partitioned, so. You, how about we go down the line? You actually introduce yourself. Mr. Casey, would you, would you start us off? Hi! 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 I'm Chris K. Oh, somebody get that. I'm uh, Chris Casey, and I continue to be Holy Roman Empire, and I'm very happy to be here, and that's the extent of my stuff. Thank you! Hi, I'm Sherry Lee, and I play Lichtenstein in the I'm Ian, I'm Leigh Romano, and that is the extent of my interview. I'm Scott Friesen. I play Rick Glenn. I got it too. Just so I can confuse some of you. That is all. Thank you for coming! Good night. Planned out until the end when we totally auction stuff. It's gonna be awesome. Which I will give a disclaimer in this. Last night in Soul Leader, um, uh, yeah, look at that. Somebody was there. We had cake, by the way. Cake is good. We don't have cake for this panel. Sorry. Uh, but uh, it's gonna be awesome for itself because it's Italia. Anyway, uh, Soul Leader versus Italia versus Black Butler. We're all auctioning off items. Whoever raises the most money for cancer is the winning show of the weekend, I have decided. Uh, and I'm going to enforce it because I will be at all three panels. And I have to win, so this is going to happen. You're getting in your way. So, the other thing that we're doing, because I haven't decided if I'm a hero or a villain, whoever wins the item gets to dictate what that panel was, a hero or a villain panel. So last night was a hero panel, so at this moment, I am a hero, because he was a hero, so if you guys are villains, then it will continue. So, there we go, that's, that's enough.
We're out of my Google machine. How you doing? Can I have something that'll change the subject? Hey, hey, Mama, could I have some money? Hey, hey, Miss Brigham, I believe the last question was. The question was, if you could play another adventure, which would be, and can you do just a little bit? Would you, would you like to Okay, Brina, we'll do it. Uh, I think Payson really wants to be Team Italian, and I really want to be Team If you ever get to see one of these videos, I love you so much. I love that dude. He took me to go get hot dogs, and I would uh, want to be him because every time I watch the show, I sit down afterwards, I just go to go to the screen. I be him. I would be American. <laughs> I wouldn't have to do a stupid accent. Hey, I'm America. Hey. annoying little sister that I could just rip off everybody else's accent and be everybody's little sister who shows up and imitates. So like, like America, whatever America says, he's like, hey, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go kill those guys. Yeah, I'm gonna go kill those guys. He's like, harass everybody. Harass All right, questions, any more questions? This is, this is getting good. Pick you to begin with.
Leben. So, what, just start down the line here? What do you do? You're just talking like that. I'm talking about the mic, so stop. Um, hello. Uh, I pointed everything. And I started pretty much everything, so uh, congratulations, me, and you're all welcome. You see? This guy over here will be the empire in the moment. How's that empire going for you, huh? <laughs> And you got the Falkland Islands, huh? Oh. oh. And all for all those sheep that you really need for your empire, huh? Let's go one for you. Do, 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 keep that up, okay? Any 
so standing in the paint. Oh. Uh, so I'm going to steal from the great director of Italia. Stealing is wrong. Which one? <laughs> what, what, I'm just going to ask a question. Here's Did you yeah. learn anything from performing in the show about the nations you were part of or another nation? I learned extreme racism. <laughs> for the country of Liechtenstein, and everybody else had one that they had to imitate, and we had to marry like five together. <laughs> so, I'm going to have to really listen to all those again if we have to do the show. Oh my god, it's Chris Sabbath. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. Who? It's Christopher Robin Sabat, sorry. Um, <laughs> you, 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 you sang in this, come on up. Natalia. Oh wait, did you guys already auction off that poster? Not quite, you wanna be in that? I'm supposed to sign it. Yeah, sign it and do what you wanna do. <laughs> yeah, I'll get down with you. Oh, <laughs> Alright, you have had your hand up with so much passion for the last time. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Natalia, what was your favorite part of the show? Um, uh, the part where you were in the car. Period, not the show, but certain voices certainly do. Romano is one of the most painful things I've ever done. <laughs> yeah, the one thing. No, it's just it's he screams a lot and it, he talks really fast, and so you gotta scream a lot. It's totally worth it, but you know, you've been through a lot. Voice is a muscle, it gets tired. Yes. How about right here in the front?
Now the best of the furthest over here in the front. Italy, quick, easy, painless. Guys, I'm going to do the same thing that I'm more because my brother is not very smart. And that way, when people are like, oh, you're Italy, I'm like, yes, it's Italy. I'm like, well, you're you Italy. I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> 
<laughs> so I would rather just be able to at least feel that uh, longing for, how long is it? A couple of days? Was it one day? Two days? A week? A week? Oh, hold on. That's you. <laughs> My answer isn't good. I lied to everyone here. Um, no, no. I, I still would like to. I'll be in for, I'll, yeah, I'll be in for a week. It would annoy me otherwise. That's the answer. I would, I would hit him in the first. Hey, you. Her only obsession would be her brother. And maybe 
I think she would make pajamas out of her own clothing and write music about her brother the whole time. Uh, Holy Rome would freak out, uh, as usual, with not being able to see, uh, Italian. Yeah. Oh, I'm in the little box, going, I'm just in the box. No, it's in the box. And he'd pass out. <laughs> but actually, that wouldn't be so bad. Uh, we have a good question, I'm sure. Not so good. Is that your is that your question? Okay. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. I would I would definitely not do the accent there. <laughs> I'd get on that magic train and go to Hogwarts. <laughs> that place is cool. Magical. Uh, Alright, let's see. Uh, Alright, let's see. 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 Any more logic? Next question. Hmm. Oh, well. You and the back to the size of blue. I think your shirt is blue. It looks like it. Yeah. Oh, of course it is. See, we, we like to trust our directors, and many of us actors like to go in and have it fresh. There are some people who really want to uh, do the research, and that's, that's great when establishing a character, but sometimes it's good to get in there and experience it for the first time and really have that emotional come out. So some of us, if we know that second season's coming, we, and we know that director wants to guide us the a specific way, we just want to go for it. You didn't want to know a darn thing about Butler Terror. That's so funny. You lied to me. You lied every time.
show people. <laughs> Natalia Bob. Pet uh, They all know. Yeah, where is he anyway? I would say, how would you know?
Character or actual? Because I will go on for about 45 minutes about actual British food. Oh no, the character? Oh. Actually, British food is really turned around. It's been given a more... It's been given a bad reputation because a bunch of British chefs came over here a long time ago and were like, oh, this is British food. And they just boiled a bunch of stuff while the good chefs had jobs in England. They continued to evolve British cuisine. And actually, it's a pretty darn tasty... It's not, not sure. just bangers and mash. It's really good in England. Yeah. That's about it. <laughs> yes, their national dish is a curry. But, but, a curry like you find in England is not found in India. It is a purely um, London built thing. Oh, I'm not denying that whatsoever. I like fish and chips. Oh, fish and chips. A traditional English breakfast. Have you had one of those? Yes, they're delicious. So good. They're great. So good. Very good. Can we have those tomorrow? Yes. Our opinions are ruining oh, things. Big beans and sausage, a little grilled tomato, and there's bacon, Canadian bacon, and blood sausage. So with blood sausage, you, you congeal blood and you mix it with um, you mix it with rice and other stuff, and you put it in the Oh, the human hand. Yeah, that's the lunch. Ramsey. You asked. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. You, you're, you're doing this, so I'm gonna just do it. Ask you because I don't want you to hear yourself. Have you ever seen Shaun of the Dead? Yes, but they can't make it to sea land. You just gotta knock out whatever residual zombie is at sea land, and no zombie's gonna get to sea land because no one wants to go to sea land. Unless they're zombies! <laughs> and then you're gonna be fine. And if they become a zombie, I'll push them.
I guess it was Wednesday. My day was How about you? Like you just don't care. Oh no, hold on. Somebody had a Lichtenstein doll in the air? Was that a Lichtenstein doll? 
Oh, 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 You all look so apathetic now. Um, how about you? With a disinterested look. Oh, okay. Our characters. 
favorite superhero be? Dude, he's the Captain Britain. <laughs> I think uh, Batman, because, <laughs> because then he can say, "Oh, I am, I am Batman." <laughs> I know the hat would be over the cowl, the ears would be fantastic. <laughs> uh, let's see. I, I am a Batman. <laughs> So we need about a minute long cue of you throwing up. So I just, I watched the timer and took a deep breath and just went, 
and write about last five seconds and actually turn the fucking And then I had to swallow it. And they were like, are you, are you like, oh, fuck. Yeah, no refund. It was so chunky. My old friend, Jilly. I really do. I think him and Germany together, their stuff together is just... I think, I think Clarine is hilarious oh, as well. Yes. Like, there's something... That's why... Yeah, so she's my, like, my favorite. Because, like, it's hilarious. Uh, really big? I like it when the narrator goes, uh... uh China? <laughs> I'd say Japan, honestly. Everything Japan does. Because that, man, if you have to record after he's already recorded, you have a line that, like, follows up something he just said, it's... Nearly impossible to get it on the right. I mean, it's, it's nearly impossible. It's such wonderful butchery. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool. That's unbelievable. Okay. Who hasn't asked a question yet? We're going to have those people. Oh, yeah, in the back with the Brit. Everybody get the cameras, yep. <laughs> That's why, that's why Romano, when you were using the language, I decided to have a lot of Spanish tones for it, and consonants and stuff, so... I didn't know that! And I'd say a lot of times. The whole bit about Sealand, I mean... Yeah, what, I don't know. That was weird. I mean, the whole, the whole accent thing, like I said, I mean, literally, we watched so many, there's like a website that everyone um, <laughs> but there, it's, it's a smaller country and it's surrounded by so many different ones. It's a melting pot of all these different accents, which I thought that was very unique. So it's a very diverse country, which I thought was cool. Uh, are you in the back with the hand? This is the first thing. Five, what uh, historical event would you like to see? All of it, and I did. <laughs> I got paid for it. I'm actually illiterate, and I don't read, so I don't know anything about history, so there's... <laughs> Economic problems. <laughs> All right. Great. What a, what a depressing... 
depressing moment. <laughs> For the love of God, somebody has something to beat. This is terrible. Uh, how about you? Yeah. Is it Poland? On a scale from one to cool, he's super cool. Yeah. Good times. Uh, the time of How about, how about you with the hand in the yes. Tasty. It's, 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 I will rotate 
Chuck, you share your bad face? I have a, I have a, um, I mean, throat cut is a big one, and then that, that gel. Well, yeah, it's like that, that gel gel uh, cold. Oh, it's really cool. Like, my, uh, my show, people see the word, there's no lines of oranges, and lemon, and then all these things. And there's no lines of jelly. And then you see that it's really nice. It's like, 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 it's like,
Ian, you, you want to get rock? Oh. Fiddlesticks. Okay. All right. Well, I tell you what, guys. Okay. So, everyone has everyone met um, the cancer? He's the guy that shows up at parties and really makes it awkward is it, and is uncomfortable. Everyone know cancer? Yeah. You know cancer, breast cancer, skin cancer, ovarian cancer, things like that. You know them. They usually show up in a group and they really make the part. They're really Debbie Downers. Um. So, are you guys familiar with this? Do you know people in your life that have had cancer? Okay, have you guys had cancer? No, not all of you? Okay, well, like I said, nobody's saying anyways. I have, my mother has, my aunt has, we've all had cancer, and it sucks. So, right now we're raising money for charity for cancer. As you know, there are a lot of charities going on, but they, they all go towards this, this cancer fund so we can, you know, when they show up at the party, we can have a big Mario hammer over to hit them. Um, look at that. Oh, the cancer fans. Cancer fans, they're leaving. They're offended right now. I'm sorry, you love cancer. Have fun at your beating puppies and drowning kittens panel. It's cool. There goes benign, malignant skin and ovarian cancer right there. That's all right. You know, different strokes for different cancers. So, uh, all right, we're raising money for cancer. What we have right here... Well, is we've got, you know, we've got a little something, something. This is signed by everybody up here, everyone that were major players in Italian. These little cards, you really can't get them anywhere else. So, uh, we, we'll start this bidding up with uh, 10 bucks. We'll do 10 bucks. Uh, we've got 10 bucks. We, we have 20. We have 20 bucks. 20 bucks down here. Do we have 30? 30, right. We've got 40? 40 bucks. 40. $50. We have $50, anyway. $50 to the person that doesn't like cancer showing up at their parties. Do we have $60? $60. $60. $60 will get you either an Xbox video game that you can play for 10 to 12 hours that might be an 8.5 to maybe a 9, or you can help cancer. $60, anyone? No, no $60. Bucks. Okay, you know what? Do you want to give me an Xbox? You have Xbox 360? Okay, what game are you playing? Skyrim, you know what? That's that's on par with helping cancer, but we're glad you're doing it. See, do I have $70? $65? $62? $62? It's adventure time! Okay, $70. Can someone beat that by $70? $70. That's, that's 70 bucks right there. You've just bought a video game in Canada because they rack up the price. $70. Do I have $80? $80, anybody? $70? We're going to go $70. This is a signed postcard by everyone up here. It's $66, but that's less than $70. So $70 it still is, but thank you for that effort. Uh, $70, we have $80. $80, anyone? $81, anyone? $81.50, anybody? I'll give you a discount. We'll make it $80. $80 again. $80 anybody? $70 going once, $70 going twice, and sold to that Adventure Time lady right there. Thank you very much. Very gracious of you. Do not run into those cancer people that just left. They're not going to be happy with you. There we go. You're so... Hey, so 80, tell us your name. Caitlin. Caitlin, where are you from? Uh, you doing the con? What? How long have you had cancer? Good. Since I knew about it. Good answer, good answer. Okay, so when you see cancer, are you going to A, punch it, B, kick it, C, all of the above? Uh, B, kick it, and then punch it. Get in the head in its soft spot, that's good, good for you. Cancer has a lot of soft spots. Good for you, that's very great. A hand for Caitlin right here. Awesome. Oh, uh, uh, hero or villain? The character of your Van Damme's character from Expendables 2, it's Milan is the name. And in the credits, it's actually spelled Milan. It's great writing there, Milan. Anyway, okay. So uh, we've got a wall scroll. Now this is, a, this is a bigger item. Let's open that bad boy up, Ian. Uh, and so this is signed by everyone, and I'm about to add the last signature, I believe, right? I think so. Oh, this has got a ton of people. Oh, no, no. I already did it right there. Okay, so we've got McFarland. We've got Abercorn. We've got uh, other stuff. We've got Brina. We've got Clinkenbeard. Colleen Clinkenbeard. We've got Scott, Scott Sager. We've got Scott Sager. We've got Christopher Sabbath. We've got Clarine Hart. Patrick Sykes. Ian Sinclair. We've got Christopher Bevins. I don't know what the, someone had a stroke and wrote that. Oh, Alexis Tempton. Um, we've got uh, who is that? Lucy Christian. 
We got Greg uh, Bishop, Jeremy Jones, Marina Polinsky, yeah. Jeremy yeah. Lee, Chris Payson, yeah. and one other signature wow. that I, I, I wow. I've seen a lot. I cannot tell what that is. That's some sort of scribble, but it's something good. Uh, I can't even tell. Switch, Switzerland? Switzerland. Switzerland. Who is Switzerland? It's a lot cooler in here. Your brother. Okay. Good answer. So, a lot of people, and really difficult people that you really can't get. Lucy Christian, good luck trying to get that signature, but it's right here. We're going to start the bidding of this because it has so many people, people that aren't even at this convention. We're going to start this one at $50. Can we do $50? Is that okay? $50 right there? Yeah, there we go. Raise it proud. There we go. $50. How about $60? $60 bucks more. In the back, $60. With a little. How about $70? $70 for this wall score that you really, I mean, honestly, you can't get these signatures everywhere. Bevins, very rare. Scott, oh God, Scott Sager, you will never get his signature. Um, he's a curmudgeon. But no, it's just, it's hard for him to come out. He doesn't come out a lot. Where are we at, 60? Are we at 70? We got 70 right here. Do we have 80? 80, 80 in the back? 80 in the back for a wall scroll. That goes, you know what? You know where it goes? It goes on a wall. $80, do we have $90? $90, $90, thank you, to help punch cancer in the face with those brass knuckles. $90, you have $100. $100 for this wall scroll. Really, I mean, Lucy Christian, she's popping out another child. You're never going to see her, so, unless, you're, unless you become her child. Um, do we have $90? $90? $100? $100? $100? $90? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? $100? Yes? No? $100? Bucks? $100? Bucks, $100? Bucks. We have $110 for this. $110 for this wall scroll that's been touched by Ian Sinclair. He is rubbing it on his person. Do we have $110 for this wall scroll? $110, bucks, $110, bucks, $110 from a big supporter of Full Metal. Yes. And Claymore yesterday it was awesome. $110 right here. Do we have more cancer supporters? Oh my gosh, she just cheered for cancer. Oh, that, she looks like a brain tumor to me. $110 right here. Do we have any more than that? $120 maybe? $120 right there? $120 right there? Yeah, that's a good one. $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $110? $
Yes! John would say that as well, I guess, eh? No, I'm kidding. Villains hate cancer, too. Yeah, yeah, cancer sucks, guys. You know who likes cancer? Voldemort. And where is he? He's dead. <laughs> okay, so, there we go. <laughs> Just letting you know there. He was gonna die anyway. He doesn't have a nose. He has no filter for the nasty air. He goes to L.A. one time, he's dead. <laughs> um, very cool, guys. Very, very cool. I think, okay, so I guess we're, uh, this, this was it. We had a great, can I get a round of applause for other Scott? Mr. Ian Sinclair, Frida Palencia, the gorgeous Jeremy, who is a villain, and Mr. Christopher Kaysen. He is a villain. And thank you very much. I'm Todd Howard, and I hope to see you at 3 o'clock at the Superheroes panel. Bye bye! Just another 